Yo, what's good everybody? Um, Coach Yumi here, we're back for episode 11 of the FIU Diamond, uh, <laughs> FIU Dynasty, one take, one take. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do a quick breakdown, as you can see, number one Michigan did lose to Minnesota in, in the rivalry game that they have, um, so that's interesting, um, so yeah, real quick, we're just gonna go through everything in terms of other teams, just go through this real quick. So we're gonna start with our conference standings. Um, so as you can see, I did sim, I think until our game, or I could be wrong. I don't remember where I saved this at. But as you can see, we're second in the conference. We have a five-one record. Um, that one loss is to West Western Kentucky. So I do hope that we are able to see them um, back when it comes down to the bowl game, or sorry, the conference championship game. Um, Independent, Notre Dame's at 5-5, five and five. UConn and Army are just falling off. Um, Mountain West, you got Utah State still leading, Hawaii and Wyoming right there. Washington is first in the conference. Um, they do have Utah and USC right there behind them, so this is going to be interesting how this shakes out. Um, Georgia's still leading, Texas A&M, Old Miss are currently battling for two. We'll see how that shakes out. Let me see, who do they play? Mississippi State, Stanford. Okay, so we'll see how that goes. Um, quick East West. All right, Sun Belt, we got Coastal Carolina, Georgia Southern battling for one. Arkansas State could sneak in there, then Appalachian State is teetering. Um, just quick East West. NCAA, as you can see, Ohio State's number one. I did sort of spoil that. We'll get to that. Uh, ACC, North Carolina, 6-0. and Florida State, 6-1. Uh, and Boston College, 5-1. and So this could shake either way. Um, Cincinnati, NC State. Okay. So we got the Big Ten. Uh, Ohio State's leading, 6-0. and um, They do play Penn State. They did win last week against uh, Wisconsin. Michigan did lose to, to Minnesota. Huge upset. Um, now they play Michigan State in their rivalry game. They're 5-1, still looking for the Big Ten Conference Championship. But they are number 11, as you can see. So a little bit of a spoiler. East-West. Um, wait, did I miss something? Yeah, I'm tripping. Okay, so we got the Big 12. We got Oklahoma right here, 6-0. Oh. Uh, Cincinnati, 5-2. Texas Tech at four and two, but it's looking like these two might match up here. Um, got the American Conference UAB six and two, Tulane and UTSA both five and one. So we'll see how this shakes out. Um, and then yeah, so that's everything for that. Players of the week, just gonna go through NCAA. I don't feel like going through everything right now. Uh, Ray Davis, Cedric Gray, awards semifinalists. Um, so we got Caleb Williams for the Maxwell. I'm just going to go through who's leading. Um, sorry about that. We got Cedric Gray for the Bernard. Um, Caleb Williams for the O'Brien. Uh, Javante Barnes for the Walker. As you can see, Aiden Davis is in fifth place. I'm extremely proud of him as a freshman. That's definitely, uh, something he could be in the top three for with these guys. Um, and then, yeah, we're just going to quickly just scroll through some of these. Um, as you can see, our linemen are just killing it. Uh, so we're going to have someone hopefully bring home one of these awards. Um, here we go. Just sort of skipping through some of these. Um, it'd be a lot to go through everything. Time-wise, uh, Heisman watch. We got Kayla Williams still leading. Henderson moving up to second place. Barnes down to third. Drake May in fourth. And then we got Coastal Carolina's quarterback moving up to fifth place. That's interesting. All right, that's cool. Um, so top 25, Ohio State, Utah, North Carolina, Oklahoma, and Washington round out your top five. Not going to go through everything. Um just gonna quickly scroll through Michigan big upset went from 1 to 11 uh, losing to Minnesota for the third time I'm mentioning I know um, 
yeah, so just quick breakdown. Coastal Carolina moving up big with a win over Georgia Southern, who I think was ranked. Yeah, they were ranked 21. So they move up to 17. Um, Texas fell off. They lost to BYU. Interesting. Um, UTSA is back ranked. I think they were ranked to start off the season, fell off. Whoa, TCU fell off to West Virginia. Oh, wow. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Um, yep. So that's your top 25 BYU and Purdue sneaking in there. Um, Florida, Georgia Southern, Wisconsin, and Tulane all fall out. Playoff ranks. Um, just going to quickly go through this. Utah is actually leading crazy. Okay. <laughs> all right. So just going to quickly scroll through. Um, feel free to pause the video whenever this goes up on YouTube. If you really want to see who's there. But Washington State rounding out the, th uh, the 30th spot. In season re recruiting. Um, so we do have a soft verbal for a tackle, which we do need. Um, this guy, we're hoping that we, we can get him. We do have him on a soft verbal as well. Um, we may not get Dylan Davis. That's okay, though, because we hopefully can get Jalen Johnson here. Uh, we do need him. And we have Rashad or Rache Jackson. Uh, hmm. I don't know. I need to learn how to. I need to come up with a nickname or some form. But we do have him committing. So we do have a commit. I'll take that. So this week we are at New Mexico State. I'm just gonna go through a quick breakdown how we match up. So we, if you look, we're actually the number one ranked defense um, in the nation. Could not have told me that when I was starting the, the, this whole series. So that's interesting. But um, yeah, our defense definitely out outweighs them. Um, they have a better offense, so that's going to be a good matchup. Um, and we both even out a B minus, so it's just going to be who wins this game. Um, looks like they're more on the struggling end of everything, so we'll see how that goes. Um, real quick, I do want to see. Can I check? I know I probably can. I just don't know how to do it. Um, no, yeah, I don't want to resign. I just wanted to sort of see. Like, can I just see where I rank in terms of national stuff? Yes, okay. We'll do it this way. I just want to see. Am I even close to getting anything bowl related? Nope, unranked. Okay. <clears throat> just curious if I was even close to getting a bowl bid at all. All right. So, um, real quick, real quick, before we go to my game. Ooh. Okay. We're just going to see if Ohio State and Penn State does get simulated. We are just going to quickly peep to see who did win that. Um, I do want to see top 25. Anything else interesting? This is actually interesting. The, the two newly ranked teams. <laughs> That's actually pretty cool. All right. So back to, back to me, back to me. Ohio State with the win, I think. I think I saw that correctly. We're going to quickly just breeze through that. Okay. All right, so real quick. Oh, they do run a spread. That's interesting. All right. So let's see. Just peep top 25. They did not play yet. Um, this went to overtime. That's actually very interesting. Okay. Oh, looks like Washington State just got knocked out. I think. That sucks. This went to overtime as well. Okay, okay. Looks like it's been a very interesting week. College football. Ohio State looks to retain that number one spot. Alright. 
let's let's hop into the matchup of the week. Um, so I did run through every uniform combinations. Um, there was a new patch to fix one of these uniforms. When I look at it, I'm pretty sure it's this one because I know that number is not really supposed to be there. Um, so now I have free reign of jersey choices. Um, I do like the all white look. I do. I should have checked this beforehand. I just want to see. Um, so we got two away games. So our home games are done. All right. So yeah, we're gonna sport the all whites and hop into this. I should have checked New Mexico State's jerseys. I totally forgot, but oh well. We're fifty-six national ranked. Not bad. Damn, they're dead last. That's crazy. 120th is sort of crazy, my guy. What's going on here? All right, so we're going to kick off the ball. Start off this game. Ah, dang it. I chose little glitch jerseys. Well, I don't know if these are supposed to be glitched because I think the numbers are supposed to be right. Yeah, uh, excuse me on that. That's probably not a glitch. It's probably supposed to be right. Like I said, I'm getting myself back into college football by playing this. So, shout out to the next team. Um, what am I doing here? Okay, I, I was in the right spot. Let's just do a quick scouting report. Um, so, they got a senior quarterback in Roberts. Uh, Tennessee's a scrambler with 68 speed. We might just want to keep up a spy. This is a guy I'm sort of worried about, Jalen Jones, here. If he checks in. Uh, all right, so it looks like I'm assuming their impact players are probably going to be received. Oh, yeah, they got some speed. So probably going to stick with our zone. A lot of speed in that receiving core. Their tight end solid. I'm guessing a lot of their strength is defense, huh? Okay, so impact middle linebacker, 86. Fast corners below overall. All right, so we might be able to have a field day. Just got to watch out for that strong safety. All right, we'll see how, how close this goes. Just gonna go ahead. They're running a spread. I'm just gonna start with cover one. They'll take over at the 18 yard line. First and 10. Hmm. Okay, so I am gonna have to keep an eye on this quarterback. Gain of two on the play. Okay, so we're definitely going to we're gonna cover two spy. Second and eight. Ball on the twenty yard line. Get there. Ah, oh, you gotta pick that off, Mason. It's just you. Now we did get the pressure there, so that's good. I'm gonna go back to that cover two. So quick three and out, quick three and out, um, as as expected. And let's just see what our office can run. So I am gonna try to, I'm gonna mix it up. Um, I've sort of been a little too one dimensional in my offense for my liking. So I'm just gonna try to run run some plays that I ran before type of deal. Let's just start off swinging. Uh, huh, 
I say that, that I want to try to mix it up. I feel like I honestly ran a lot of my playbook. All right, let's try this. We'll try deep attack out the, out the flexible. Ball on the 31 yard line. I'm just gonna see if I can get a first, first play bomb. Good catch. Way to go, Davis. The pocket was sort of crashing on me, but we're just gonna try to be more aggressive. See if I can shut this game down early. Uh, PA read. I'm gonna try to get a tight end. Ooh, okay, bringing the pressure. We'll do it direct this way. I haven't ran this. Direct off the trips. Come on, Davis. What a dog. As y'all can see, I did try to give everyone a little bit of like a little bit of a, a drip upgrade, some uh, sleeves and here and there. Um, the linemen are next. I need to show the the linemen some love here. Alright, so we got a third and six situation. Um, let's run tight. That's from play, play action read, and I might hit Davis, but I might try to catch this on the ground, or hit Randolph, or Rudolph, sorry. I got three routes going right, so someone has to be, someone has to be there, right? Let's go. So I think that's probably my most aggressive passing drive since maybe the start of, or yeah, my, my, my most aggressive passing drive since maybe like the start of the, the whole series. Um, passing is something I do want to get better at. I don't want to be a one-dimensional, just run offense. I'd obviously want to set it up because they're good at it, but I don't, I just, I need to get the quarterback development in there. As, long, as well with the receiver development if we're going to keep moving up in the rankings. So we did put up seven. Not gonna lie, I was a little bit scared there. Thought they were going to hold us to just three, but we did get seven. Let's go back out here on defense. Um, this one a 4-4. Four, four. I don't think I really ran this all year. Um, and then we'll do a safety spy. They'll take over at the 25 yard line. First and 10. Okay, where to, where to get there? Where to get there? On the carry. Gain of four. Damn, they are really like running the ball with that quarterback, huh? Going back to 3 3, cover 2. Second and six. Ball on the 29 yard line. Ooh, direct. Come on, get there. Oh my god. Our impact linebacker just getting trucks like that? The hell is this? it 
again. Y'all got me messed up, bro. Should I have that? I'm not even gonna lie. Uh, run the max zone. Third and eleven. Ball on the thirty-five yard line. Let's get every every corner covered here. We're ooh, way to go, defense. Mason with the tip to set up the huge hit. Let's go. Number two, back to punt. Strickland, back deep to return. I should have definitely fair catch that. I wanted to get a return. Hmm. We'll try half back pass. They'll take over at the 28 yard line. First and 10. Could be a massive mistake, but we'll see. No, oh, I don't even know how to properly do it, so there's that. Davis on the run. Hmm. One yard gain on not the good, not good. Okay. <laughs> we'll go with this, this favorite play of mine. The nice off tackle. Ooh. Davis on the carry. Five yard gain on the play. Okay. Um hmm. We'll go short drags, but we're gonna look for the for the deep ball. Way to make a catch, Strickland. Let's see if we can get a playoff before half or quarter. Dang. Alright, 7 0. Uh, end, end of the first quarter. We aren't really getting any crazy explosive plays. We're just playing solid. Just playing steady. Which I'm totally fine with. Come on, someone gotta cut it upfield. Oh my goodness. Just right off the back of the helmet, man. Come on. That would have been huge. Oh my gosh. Davis on the reception. Look at the footwork. <laughs> uh we'll go five wide. We'll go five wide. Mix it up a little bit. First and ten. Ball on the twenty six yard line. My goal for him is to at least end up with 12 passing touchdowns. What a catch. Alright, now I'll 
go ahead and break off the, the wishbone. I haven't ran this all game. Um, I'm trying to get some more variety in the offense. I should have bounced it outside, but I will try the triple option real quick. Triple option, but then just give it a walk in here. for Frisbee Arts. I love, love to see it on this team. Love to see it. Um, hmm. We'll just give it back to Watkins. I probably can make something happen. Come on, Cross. Uh, Watkins with the carry. One yard gain on the play. <laughs> Do what have ran over his teammate. We're gonna go for it. Um. Hmm. Now this is what I think it is. A lot. This really is a tight end in the round. Okay. Oh my gosh! The trickery works. <laughs> Let's go, Smith. First touchdown of the year. <laughs> the trickery works. Let's go, 14-0. And we're, we're looking to get the ball back towards half. So let's just try to get another stop here on defense, and we're good. 11 plays, 72 yards, almost four, four minutes of possession time. So not bad. Um, definitely did drain a lot of clock, making it harder for them. But we just gotta make sure we stay on top of our game here. We can't have any stupid turnovers and let them get into it. Um, so it is... So they are going to be running to an offense. I mean, they still will have a challenge. Honestly, they have to pass the ball. Oh no. Alright, me and I were going to go. At least for the We're gonna keep that spot here. I ain't, no, you aren't. You aren't getting away from me, Roberts. Because now they're in the field where you keep doing that. Okay. Good job, defense. Well, yeah, we need our secondary to lock in a little bit. We'll go deep three switch. Oh no. Oh, come. Ooh. Oh. 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 What a play. Hang on. This is this is this is one of those those moments you just have to. You have to watch greatness unfold. Please tell me that was Ballard that makes the play, right? Okay, so here we go. He makes the catch. You know, he breaks the tackle feeling good. Right, 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 right. Boom! Good job, defense. Way to make a play. 
All right, let's go five wide. Let's just let's just air it out. Oh my gosh, she actually caught it. What a play. Alright, we're gonna go back to the spread. Uh, let's go slot, slot wheels. Oh no. I guess because I didn't mm, I didn't touch anything after that, so he just sort of just auto ran a play. Damn that sucks. Okay. I was trying to I was trying to let Strickland get open. Alright, we'll go deep post. Let's see if I can unwork myself off this situation. That should have been picked. Yeah, he was right there waiting on it. Hmm. We got trips. Uh, trying to clear out. Bro, this auto throwing stuff is sort of annoying. I need to take that off. Alright, whatever. Oh, I'm punting the ball? Okay. Um. Sure, I guess I'll punt it. Ah, come on, man. That's ass. Okay. The New Mexico State Aggies take over at the 45 yard line. First and 10. Excuse me. Come on, get there, get there. So yeah, they're running out of time here. Uh -huh, let's just go pre prevent four. Third and ten. Ball on the twenty-five yard line. Yeah, they're probably just gonna let the clock drip. Alright, so solid first half. Um, not a crazy lead or anything. Uh, I'm going to do a quick breakdown. So we're up 14-0. Uh, basically, we're beating them in all categories. Um, yeah, basically just out, out playing them. Um, and if we just keep it up, this is going to be an easy win for us without having to do much. Uh, as you can see, they don't have much going on. Um, looks like Chamberlain's been their best player so far with four tackles. Uh, Davis with a tackle for a loss, one sack. 
and they don't have any picks, so we're never gonna look at that. Then for us, um, Ballard with the two tackles and a forced fumble. Uh, he's been doing good, and then we got Mason doing good with two two deflections out there, one tackle for a loss. Uh, he's been having a good game. Douglas with eight pancakes. That's crazy. Davis, uh, three catches, 58 yards. Strickland, three catches, 37. Well, we've been trying to spread the ball. I need to get Russo more involved. Davis, 37 rushing yards. Uh, and then Killer Cam with 143 passing yards and one touchdown. So not bad. Um, we're doing good. And I think I'm just going to go back to my normal offense, which is... I should just run the ball and just pass when necessary. Oh, this is not how we wanted to start. All right, time to lock back in. Okay, well, they just gave us something to worry about. <laughs> this man, Aiden Davis, has a lot of fumbles on the year. I'm nervous. I mean, he's a freshman, but come on, bro. We can't have this man. to spread now or on the direct first and 10 ball on the 37 yard line I mean better than what it was it was gonna be so I'll take it Second and eight. Ball on the 39 yard line. Gee, they just know everything. 363 inside four. Cut. Come on, seal that block. <laughs> Let him know, Davis. Let him know. go so this should have been 21 0 but I'll still take a 21 7 lead I'm not mad at that Dang, that 
sucks. We just can't get there. I really feel like that's back to back play that should have been there. In the backfield, hitting the quarterback. So now we're gonna run max zone. On the yard line. Just get everything covered. Three and three inside four. Hot. You're kidding me. Johnson makes the catch. They're definitely a second half, second half team. Right there. Oh, just like that, it's a game, huh? This is really going wrong, huh? <laughs> this is really going wrong. <laughs> this is why you just do touchbacks, ladies and gentlemen. Give it right back to him. I'm running the ball from here on out. I'm just going to go back to my bread and, my, my bread and butter. Oh, come on. I should have juked to try to stiff arm. Mild concussion, but it's only for the game. Fam. This is back in the day where fucking you would just play through them shit so on. On the run, 19 yard gain on the play. First and ten, ball on the 47 yard line. That's ridiculous. Incomplete pass. Number 87, the intended receiver on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 47 yard line. Ball 
last session. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, so we're back up too. It's a very close game. But we are back up too. a stop and at least three points on the board that's it that's the game coming on the carry gain of four on the play second and six ball on the 29 yard line come on break yes and then blow that off Loss of two on the play. Third and eight. Ball on the 27 yard line. Our fourth quarter. We got our virtual players throwing up the virtual fours. Third and eight. Ball on the 27 yard line. Oh my goodness, man. Huff is just not a good he, He's just not good at playing the ball. That dude just lets me down every time. Come on, there we go. Barry on the interception. Return for a gain of 19 yards. Let's go. Way to seal the game. To me, this is this this is a seal. Ira Berry. Another yawn. I'm sorry. I'm tired. <laughs> but Ira Berry. Another big play for us. They'll take over at the 24 yard line. First and 10. Number nine with the yeah, that wasn't going to go how I wanted to go. <laughs> Second and 11, ball on the 23-yard line. Now we're just going to run out some uh, clock. I should have stayed in balance, but wasn't really thinking about it. Davis on the run, gain of 12 on the play. Okay, so big, big first down. First we're just going to keep, keep feeding Davis. Oh no, he's fumbling, isn't he? Oh, Jesus, he sat him down though. <laughs> he sat my dog Davis down, jeez. Ball on the 34-yard line. 
We'll go tight end cross. First and ten. Ball on the twenty-three yard line. Let's go, Robinson. And that is basically the game. Uh that's the end of the season. I'm not gonna lie, they, they they were scaring us for a little bit though. Definitely was scaring us for a little bit. So 35 14. Let's just go out here and just play some defense. And let's just get out of here. This time I'm actually confident in what I'm saying. Last time I started off the half confident, that was terrible. Incomplete pass. Johnson, the intended receiver, on the play. Second and 10. Ball on the 25 yard line. Oh, come on. Y'all gotta get there. Number 21 on the reception. Five yard gain on the play. Third and five. Ball on the 30 yard line. Oh my goodness. Roberts on the run. Seven yard gain on the play. Yeah, this is this is sort of crazy. What the fuck? Cops, the ball carrier. Gain of fourteen on the play. Do it again? Can't stop this guy. Cops on the carry. Five yard gain on the play. What the fuck? Okay, all right. <laughs> Just watch them spam a play all the way up field, but if it, I mean, if it works, it works. Say. Lock that up. Get out of here. They'll take over. Right, so we're just gonna run the ball. First and ten. Uh, and just get out of here. Hundred and eighty six yards is crazy. Just 
Jesus, man, celebrated his ass off for that first talk. I ain't mad at it. It's just funny. First and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. That's a fire screen. I need to run that more. 11 yard gain on the play. Jesus, Davis, why are you talking so much shit? That's fourth and conduct. On the offense. 15 yard penalty. First down. Like, jeez, bro. We, we get it. We are up. First and long. Ball on the 30 shit, I had 200 rushing yards. I, I'd, I'd be talking shit too. The fastball is incomplete. Davis. Well, that wasted a lot of time on the ball, so the I am mad. Second and long. Ball on the 38 yard line. Jesus. Murray makes the sack. On the ten, on the way. Well, I'm not too fond of that. What is the third and thirty five? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Strickland is a dog. Talk about a dot. Jesus. Look at the look at this dot. Yeah, that's definitely what I need to make sure. Make sure one way we definitely seal out the game. <laughs> Too much war well, now, yeah. We'll just put power into it. Fuck it. Doesn't matter. We're just gonna run prevent. First and ten. Ball on the twenty five yard line. I was gonna say you ain't getting nothing. All right, that's your final. Forty-two, fourteen. Your FIU Panthers take home another dub. Coach Yumi gets another win in in the record books. Um. So that's another crucial conference win that we definitely needed. Um. I did state before that all the games left on our schedule were definitely must-win games that we really needed um 
So after this game, this next game, um, which I think is Jacksonville State, could be wrong there. But after this next game, I'm definitely gonna move it up to Heisman. Um, I think I'm at the point where All American isn't that much challenging to me anymore. Um, I've obviously improved. I got better at the game since compared to the first episode when I first started. I haven't played this game in a minute. Um, you know, just I, it's just like everything else. Once you start to play a game and stuff for a little bit, you obviously start to get better. You start to learn the ins and outs, the, the, the mechanics a little bit more. Um, and that's where I'm at with this. So definitely uh, one more game on All-American, and then we're moving up to Heisman. And we're just going to see what the competition is like at Heisman. I know it can get crazy cheesy, but whatever 15 yards an average is insane that's all i gotta say um receivers had a day man strickland especially uh russo is out for the game but thankfully it's just only the game um everyone just did their job everyone did their thing uh quality quality win um we are gonna go ahead and get out of here um i do want to see the tennessee and georgia um, matchup just to see who wins that game if we do have an upset I'm just going to do a quick sim of that uh, let's see we'll go ahead and save the game files so we do move to 7-4 um, I'm going to assume Liberty just beat Louisiana Tech I do sort of want to check that real quick and I'm also going to check in on Western Western Kentucky because that's the team I want in this bowl this bowl championship game. I don't want any other team escaping me. They are the other team that we want re revenge on. So, hmm. all right. So they play that. All right. So what I'm going to do is this. Because I do want to see the result of this. Close game. Georgia pulls out the upset. Or pulls out the win. Um, I do want to see this. Does Michigan slide? Nope. They stay. And who wins the battle of the newly ranks? Coastal Carolina with a just stomping. Okay, so it looks like Coastal, Coastal Carolina is serious. Um, and this game. Western Kentucky barely beats Jacksonville State. So it's, it's, it's looking like it's shaping up to be. It's shaping up to be. Um, but all right, that's it for, for this episode. I will catch you all in the next episode. Peace. This is Coach Yumi signing out. Later.